do I break the rules or follow them? Um, well, that's a very good question. Um, I take inspiration from lots of other photographers. Um, my scrapbook, my download folder of, uh, of um, inspirational imagery is epic. Um, and it's not just straight photographs shot by other people as well. Um, it could be just colors. It might be a sweet wrapper that's got a certain color to it that's on a road that's um, got some late afternoon sunshine on it. So maybe it's the mixture of the purple sweet wrapper and the late afternoon sun. And I'll take those two colors and I will, you know, I will build them into the next shoot I do. Maybe the model is going to have the purple as her clothes and maybe I'll get the background painted in the same golden tone as the sun. So that's where my inspiration might come from there. But um, with regard to breaking any rules, I, I don't think there's too many rules to be broken. I think I take inspiration from a real wide range of sources. Uh, sometimes I will see the color grade on someone else's work and think, wow, that's beautiful. And I will maybe notice that I will start to make a color grade a bit similar on another shoot that I do. But so I think it's just pieces of inspiration that come in. And I don't really think there are any rules. Uh, on, a, on a shoot a couple of weeks ago, I normally darken the edges of my pictures. In the end, I just got the slider and I made the edges light. I don't know why, but I quite liked it. So I supplied that, that client with all of the portraits with light edges rather than dark. I mean, that's kind of my rule to make, really. I just decided to put the slider the other way. So um, I, I think, um, you know, certainly with regard to traditional photography, people talk about things like composition and rule of thirds. I just think you can do what you want, do whatever you want that makes makes the shot as, as, as creative and, and as satisfying for you as, as possible.